which is a series I definitely want to try bringing back at some point because I love doing like some extremely modded packs or bring back maybe like hardcore knots of vanilla. Those those are fun. Okay, so Khan's place doesn't seem like it's been too or scoop no groovies. Is this groovies? I think this is groovies. Um, yeah, it's groovies. Okay, groovies place doesn't seem like it's been too much updated. Um, still seems uh, roughly the same. His, the map's still up. Awesome. And my, my, my signs are still here. Awesome. Okay. So I'm glad the sign's still there and show, it still marks where our houses are. Which I really love because that just helps basically like map out the region. I'm not sure if it's a glitch or not because Joe was mentioning it at one point. How he, how he doesn't think that it's meant to do that. And how I kind of glitched it to make the marks. I, I'm not 100% sure on that, but if it works, it works. Hey. I wonder if Joe's made any progress on his place on the other houses, though. We'll go check that out as well. Hey, yeah, things to do. Yay, well, we try to figure out everything else. <laughs> I love how I can see my house from here. That's so cool. God, that's awesome. <clears throat> as I run over Ruth Forest biome, I feel like setting this whole place on fire. Wow! Whoops. Oh, now we're running through the root forest biome. And now we're out of it. That was fun. Is it about to rain? Or is it just getting dark? I think it's just getting dark. Room's home. Home free. We'll get to the house. We'll sleep in the bed. Then we'll hop up on... Um, we'll uh, head through the portal. Go over to Joe. See if, see if he has any progress in this place. And actually, just for the hell of it, I will reveal to you guys what that fourth troll was that I ended up doing that I don't think Joe ever, ever caught. And like I said, it's so small, it's so insignificant, but it's just meant to be there just to piss off Joe. So if he hasn't noticed it, yay. If he has, fuck. Okay, yeah, my gates are up. Damn it. Um, actually, I should just be able to... Yeah. Can, can I... Damn it. Fuck my own security system. <laughs> yeah, and the stairs are up too. Yay. However, I did make it so I can easily get in myself. Which mobs should be able to path, but for some reason they don't. Oh, fuck. Alright. That's cool. Alright, so let's go sleep in the bed. Since that mobs... Oh, wait, never mind. I guess not... I was going to say, since uh, that zombie was pathfinding me, I wasn't sure if I was going to be allowed to sleep. But, hey, I'm allowed to sleep, so awesome. Um, okay. So let's head off over to Joe's. And you know what? Actually, let's just take a horse. Okay. Yeah, we'll just take a horse because... I mean, we might as well go check out some of the land as well. And since I'm not lagging anymore, horses are just a fine way to travel now. And honestly, for how long it takes me to load up the nether and everything, this might actually be a little bit faster. Yep, so we got all the crops over here. I forgot if horses trample. They're not good. Right, we still, Lily's place is right there. I don't know if Jalo ever made a place. I wish she did. Um, whose is this? Do they have supplies? Yeah, they have some. They have emeralds. Damn. Yeah, I don't know whose place this is. That's another thing. We need to find llamas. I keep on forgetting about that. We need to find llamas. But I don't think we have an extreme hills anywhere near. What the fuck is that? Excuse me. What are you doing? What is... What kind of... What is that? Excuse me, but what is this block? It looks like a dro is that is that like the new dropper? It hasn't harvested anything. I think this is supposed to harvest pumpkins when they come out. But what is this? There's no daylight sensor, so I think I think the way that it works is I think that's a block updater block. 
I mean, uh, uh, updater like thing. What what it was it called? When there's a block update that activates with the redstone signal, I think that's what that is. So when that activates with the redstone signal, that pumps that up, which then cr- finishes the circuit, pumps that down to break the block, and then the block. Does it go through into the hopper? I wouldn't think that that would be a thing, but hold on real quick. Let me. I don't, I don't have a melon or anything. To test this out with. I want to test this though. Why are you way over there? I want to test this. Um, do we have... There's pumpkins right there. Okay, I'm going to grab a pumpkin. And test my theory out. I think that is like one of the new block updater blocks. Like, it's it's weird. Whenever there's a block update, then it um, activates. But I never really found a use for them. If this actually works, it's awesome. So, did that collect it? That did. Oh, that's really cool. That's actually really cool. I like that. Oh, way to go, Joe. Jeez. I just earned myself a pumpkin. So, he's been working on that. But has he finished his roof? Has not. Nope. Joe can't finish roofs. It is official. Although I did destroy his last roof because I thought he was doing it on music. And are we still filled? No. What? Wait. No. What did he do with the eggs? No. He got rid of all the eggs. I thought he was going to give up on that. Oh, and he even got rid of this chest. Damn it. He fixed everything. Aw. Did he... Did he get rid of all the eggs? Ah, Joe, you meanie. I really do think like he did something to my house that I haven't noticed. Because my door was broken last time I was on. Like, the door to nether was broken. I'm not sure if that was in an episode or not. But when I woke, um, when I came on the server to do stuff, the door to my nether was broken. Which means that either he lagged and couldn't open it or someone couldn't get through. And my troll is still here. Awesome. So if you guys really want to know what I do, what I did to his place, I trolled him besides the roof. The fourth troll was how he mentioned how this area right here, how he made it too high so zombies can come up. What I ended up doing, I ended up making, putting blocks here so it's only one high. That's all I did. But it was supposed to be an effective troll. That way zombies can run up here because he's... He went, he went out of his way to make sure that each one of these blocks were too high. And all I did was put a dirt block on each side to make and read landscape a bit to make it look natural. So he never did notice. Awesome. <laughs> I'm just a jerk like that. Anyways, um, like I said, it was extremely tiny. I just didn't want him to notice. And it was just supposed to inconvenience him. That's about it. But I don't know if Jalo ever made a place. But that's a Lily's. Don't know who this is. If anything, I would have to say this is probably, um, oh my fucking God. I forgot Rebecca's name on here. I forget. Peppa, Peppa, uh, Peppa's place. I haven't seen her in so long. That's how things have ended up. That's sad. Um, anyways, uh, then Joe's place, Joe's other place. Yeah, pretty simple. I like this circuit though. This is actually really cool. I like that idea. However, since nobody's been on in the area, I don't think it's collected anything. Also, I think they need light, which I mean it's light right now. I don't know why they aren't spawning there, but hey, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool nonetheless. Um, so yeah, one thing that we definitely need to do, we need to find that uh, Extreme Hills biome to find us llamas. That way we can start breeding them. We can start uh, putting them in our area, start making them some really cool llamas because that's something we haven't done yet. And I think that's something that we can go do. And something that I can actually function with while I'm sick. Um, so one thing. We'll head back to the house. We're going to grab a map. I think I have ran into... I think I have ran into the Extreme Hills before. I just don't know where. Jesus. Anyways. <coughs> okay. There we go. 
I don't really mind taking the damage while I bring them in. <coughs> okay. So, let's actually go and try to find some Extreme Hills biome. Z <laughs> Biomes. Okay. Let's... Map. I don't think we have any in this area. So, let's actually put this back. And let's check our map up here. Because I think this will give me a better idea. If anything, we're going to have... I mean, these are kind of extreme hills, like right there. That's kind of is, thanks to snow. The snow is definitely where we're going to be finding the extreme hills. Sadly, there isn't much down there. But, however, there is snow up there and up here. So, I'm thinking up here we may have an extreme hills biome. So, if I go grab that map, I can go and explore that area. And I'll grab uh, 10 obsidian just to make sure that we have nether portal back. Uh... Just because if it's an extreme hills biome, we're gonna want another portal. What am I doing? Maps. Okay. Jeez, my brain is bad. Um. Okay. So we got that one. Ores. Do we have any? Okay. So we have. So maybe my battery didn't die last time. Maybe it's just because it's so silent right now that my headset decided, hey, yeah, there's no sound, so we're not gonna keep functioning. Um. So I do still have the efficiency for it. So I actually don't have to worry about it if this one breaks. However, it is still a nice pick. So I'm going to worry about it if it breaks. It's whatever. Um, top down here. And then let's head over here. And we can grab some of the obsidian. That's right here. We just need uh, nine more. <clears throat> just make sure that we don't have any <coughs> lava that's going to creep up on us. <coughs> okay. Luckily, thanks to the efficiency on this pick, it doesn't take too long to mine obsidian. So we should have this pretty quickly. We're going to grab a flint steel, and then we can head off and try to find ourselves an extreme hills biome, which is where llamas spawn. And we can drag it through the nether, thanks to me having leads. And we should be just fine. I think I have leads. If I don't, I have slime balls now, so I should be able to make them. Okay, what are we at? We're at nine, so one more. Then we can head up. Find an area to place the nether portal, and we should be fine. Okay. I could take the rail cart back, but eh. We'll also take a horse with us, because I don't really care too much if I lose one of the horses. Um, I'll take, like, an iron one with me. Actually, yeah, yeah, I'll take an iron one with me. Let's eat some food. Food. Okay, let's actually grab like half my chicken just in case. Ores. I'm gonna need fun steel with me. Take the lead. And then I shouldn't need a bed. I need to have a name tag so I can actually name one later if I want to. I do want some more torches. So 19. I'll oh, just. There. Okay. There. There. Awesome. And then let's put the two cold back. Okay, so what time of day is it? Just in sunset. Perfect. Yep. So we're going to sleep, grab a horse. We're going to head over and try to find ourselves an extreme hills biome. Uh, yep, we're going to take an iron horse. Okay, let's go. Just because, like I said, I don't really care too much if I lose an iron horse. I have a lot of these. Um, <laughs> not to mention iron armor is not too great. And I put the diamond armor on the horses with more health and better speed. However, this one seems pretty fast. But hey, whatever. We're going to try to find ourselves a llama. 